Hey there! So, you want to level up your leadership game? Smart move! Becoming a top-notch leader isn't a walk in the park. It's like leveling up in a video game. It takes time, practice, and much learning. And guess what? Reading is your secret weapon. Today, I'm excited to share with you a curated selection of books that have the power to transform you into a better leader. So, without further ado, let's get into five awesome books that will turbocharge your leadership skills and set you on the path to greatness. Our journey begins with a timeless classic, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen Covey. This book lays the foundation for personal and interpersonal effectiveness. Well, Stephen Covey spilled the beans in The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. Instead of just focusing on skills and tricks, Covey says that it's all about building solid character traits. When you are in control of your destiny by shifting your mindset and focusing on what you can control, you can unlock a whole new level of success. And those seven habits, they are like your secret weapons. They help you set guiding principles, tackle important stuff first, and team up with others to crush those big goals. Leaders, take note. This book isn't just about reading, it's about doing. By adopting these habits, you will not only boost your effectiveness, but also inspire those around you to step up their game. Remember what Kobe says, so a thought, rip an action. So an action, rip a habit. So a habit, rip a character. So a character, rip a destiny. Kobe's seven habits provide a framework for success in both professional and personal life, emphasizing principles such as productivity, prioritization, and synergy. Have you ever had a boss who brought out the best in you? Liz Weizmann dives into what makes these leaders tick in their book, Multipliers. Here's the scoop. These awesome bosses, aka multipliers, see intelligence as something that can grow and expand. Instead of hoarding all the smarts, they empower their teams to shine. They dig deep to uncover each person's unique genius and then unleash it to the max. It's like they are unlocking a treasure chest of talent. And get this, when you feel valued and appreciated, you are more motivated to give it all. That's the magic of multipliers. They create an environment where everyone feels heard, valued, and inspired to bring their A-game. In today's busy workplace, it's easy to feel overwhelmed. But Fish by Stephen Lundin offers a solution. This book dives deep into the vibrant Pike Place Fish Market in Seattle revealing how even the most routine tasks can become thrilling adventures. Through playful attitudes, genuine care, and a commitment to seize every moment, the author teaches us to transform our work life into fulfilling journeys. Whether you are a manager, an employee, or simply seeking a fresh perspective on work, Fish promised to unveil the untapped potential within all of us. Personal Kanban by Jim Benson is a game changer for knowledge workers. Personal Kanban offers a simple yet powerful approach to managing your tasks and workflow. This book is perfect for beginners and seasoned knowledge workers alike, with clear guidance on applying the two key principles, limiting your work in progress and visualizing work anyone can start seeing results right away. What sets Personal Kanban apart is its accessibility. You don't need to be a developer to understand and implement the concept presented. It's all about simplicity and effectiveness. However, some readers wish Benson had provided more specific examples of applying Kanban to real-life projects, and that is the reason I created an entire video dedicated to this. The rise of various leaders in business, sports, politics, and culture has sparked a shift in society views on leadership. People no longer want traditional captains with a top-down approach. Successful organizations now thrive on collaboration, where everyone plays a part in decision-making. This idea struck me after reading Turn the Ship Around by David Market, a former nuclear submarine captain. Market believes that effective leadership means turning followers into leaders. He shares anecdotes from his time in the USS Santa Fe, showing how empowering everyone led to success. Surprisingly, more organizations still need to adopt this approach. The book is divided into four parts, each covering a crucial aspect of leadership market learned during his command. Unlike typical self-help books, it's structured to flow like a conversation. Market presents the problems, discusses control, 
competence and clarity and ends each chapter with self-reflective questions. An interesting point is how each aspect of leadership relates to the other. You can just focus on one and expect to succeed. Too much control can make teams feel inferior. Excessive competence can seem self-serving and lack of clarity leads to confusion and lower productivity. I highly recommend Turn the Ship Around as a guide for achieving your goals. Leadership isn't just about taking charge, it's about values like discipline, integrity and humility. These qualities are often overlooked in today's social media driven world, but Market's book shows they are essential for true leadership development. Leadership isn't something you are born with, it's cultivated through challenge, sacrifice and trust. I am grateful to Market for sharing these valuable lessons. If you want to know what to do when a specific person in your team is not meeting expectations, you should watch this video. Thanks for watching and see you next week.